is exactly how to turn your cheap body lotions into active brightening lotions and yes i'm going to give you step by step guide in this video if that sounds like what you are here for please give this video a huge thumbs up so many people have been complaining about Nivea, this vastly making them dark. When I tell people that I use these body lotions, they don't believe me because they believe it makes people dark. Cheap lotions make people dark. So a lot of people do not use Nivea for that major reason. But in this video, I'm going to teach you exactly how to get results from your cheap body lotions. So here is what you should know. If you want to use a cheap body lotion, you are not just going to rely on that cheap body lotion to give you all the brightening effects because you say think calm now you say reason that thing <laughs> yeah you have a lot of steps to follow and it can be cheap it can be affordable it can be expensive it depends on what exactly you are looking for so the first thing you are going to do is to get a body scrub a lot of you have not have not scrubbed your skin this year and you want to brighten it i don't understand how we want that thing to work because the major reason why we always advise people to exfoliate their skin is because exfoliation is going to help you remove dead skin cells on your body it's just like using um film or what do they call it to scrub the back of your pot do you know how how much brighter how much um neater it becomes that is exactly what body scrub is going to do to your skin so you are going to get body scrubs any body scrubs you want whether sugar scrub or whether coffee scrub or try get body scrub and start using body scrub two to three times once you start using body scrubs in your routine you are going to see that you are going to get faster results because body scrub is going to exfoliate your skin so that your skin can get the result instantly it's going to open your pores so that anything you are using on your skin is going to sink in faster or like imagine it's just like something has clogged your your skin and you are now using body lotion it's not going to be able to penetrate but once you exfoliate once you start using body scrubs two or three times a week you are going to be open to taking your body lotion so that it works faster now you don't necessarily have to use this Nivea you can get the Nivea vitamin C body lotion so apart from body scrubs you also need either bath soaps or a body wash most times i always recommend body wash for people then the next thing you need to get is brightening body wash now i have lots of body washes that i can recommend for you but i already made lots of videos about body wash so if you are wondering you can check this video to see body washes that i have reviewed on this channel that you can make use of you need but you need body wash and also get effective results from your body wash is to ensure that you are also leaving it on your skin for one to two minutes if it is bath soap that you are using too just ensure that any of them has brightening benefits like don't just be using your regular regular body wash that doesn't have any brightening effects in it because i always tell people if you want to activate um you want something to brighten your skin you're not just going to rely on a single product to do all of the work for you it is not possible if that is the case a lot of skincare brands will not exist if you can just get results from your brightening cream there will not be brightening soap there will not be brightening wash so you need to take that step by step and then you're going to follow up with your cheap lotion yes i said it so the major thing that the cheap lotion is going to be doing is to moisturize your skin once you start following all of these steps it is going to take it from like 30 percent to 70 percent because imagine you are using brightening body scrub yeah now you don't necessarily have to use brightening body scrub because personally i do not even use brightening scrubs i do not use physical scrubs at all what i use is an exfoliating cream but since we are focusing on affordable i don't want to recommend i'm latin or alpha lotion to any of you that is exactly why i am choosing to recommend the physical scrubs because it is quite affordable compared to the chemical exfoliant so physical scrubs brightening body wash or brightening bath soap now that is two steps by following that first two step first then you are going to follow up with your body lotion that your cheap body lotion yeah at most it's going to <laughs> if it's not going to brighten your skin at it will at least moisturize your skin i got this one for the deeply moisturizing effect when i tell you this one is deeply moisturizing yes it is but you can get the second one if what you do, we are looking for is the 
brightening effects that one contains vitamin c this one doesn't have anything that is brightening in it it is just a moisturizing body lotion so if you are wondering if you have of course i'm using it and my skin is older why because i am following every single step that i'm going to be telling you in this video so you can either use your vaseline your nivea any cheap lotion that you have then you are going to follow up ensure that you are doing this thing on a damp skin and when i say damp skin many of you after bathing you like to dry your skin dry that there's no single water please if you are still doing that stop doing that immediately because it's not going to help your skin your skin needs at least a little moisture Ensure that your skin is still damp. At least leave a little bit of water on your skin. Don't let everything be like Sahara Desert. Let a little water. And some of you, I hear that uh, after doing your face um, routine, your body is already dry. So if you are someone like that, I always recommend getting a spray bottle. So you are going to get a spray bottle. As you can see, I have. This is not perfume. This is a spray bottle. <laughs> I just emptied um, a perfume and poured water in it. So this is water you just get a spray bottle and what you are going to do is if your skin is already dry from doing your skincare routine and everything before you get to your body i'm going to spray your body like this so as you can see this is what they call darkness it is not dripping wet just use your hand to to like hey, this is how your skin is supposed to look then you are going to follow up with your lotion like this just put your lotion as you can see exactly this is how it's supposed to glide don't be applying your lotion on a dry skin it is not going to penetrate it's going to stay on your skin and you're not going to get the result so once it has water your skin has a little bit of dampness your pores are going to be open the skin is go the, the the lotion is going to be sinking into your skin instantly instead of all of you that just like to so this is how your body lotion is supposed to go into your skin and then the next thing that you are going to do is to now get body oil now this can be a little tricky because a lot of body oils are expensive but there are also body oils that are cheap that you can use i see a lot of people mentioning with gold on youtube i've personally not tried it so i'll tell you to do your own research or you wait for me to do a video recommending body oils for you but what you are going to do is to get body oils brightening body oil then you are going to pair it with it personally what i like to do is to pair mine with this parma's cocoa butter but i also have other body lotion body oil i use pears as well as you can see this is already empty and i have a new one already i also have this body oil from nigerian brands but i am what i'm just trying to say in the sense is that you should pair your body lotion with a oil if you like oil that are not busy then this body oil is for you now look at the difference after applying body oil on my skin look at the difference do you not get that instant glow there's no way your skin will not be bright out if you follow all of the single stuff now this is the final thing i want to add as you can see that i'm wearing a sleeveless top my neck is exposed my hands are exposed now i want to go to work like this and i'm not using sunscreen on this part of my body and i expect my skin not to get darker please how is that possible because all of these parts they are exposed to the sun that's why a lot of you say oh my god my tines are they are brighter than my whole body why because your tines are not getting exposed to the sun so your tines are covered if you know that you are not going to be wearing covered clothes or through like some part of your body are going to be exposed please and please buy sunscreen and use sunscreen on your body yes sunscreen is not just for your face use sunscreen on your body as well so if i'm to be going out now i'm going to apply sunscreen yeah yeah all of the parts that is exposed to my body i'm going to please if you're doing all of this step and you're not using sunscreen or you're not wearing covered clothes i'm not going to get infected with auto personally this is my body sunscreen i have had the time when i use atomogi sunscreen and I, that's the best option for your body that's what i'm going to recommend it is big in size it is affordable and it is it gets the job done it protects your skin so please get that to move this sunscreen and apply it to your exposed part especially if you are somebody that do not like to cover up like you like wearing the lights of sleeveless and everything please please wear sunscreen and 
that is how to activate the brightening effect from your cheap product once you start using everything like this the result you are going to get is like two times better let me know in the comment section if you have any questions and if you don't if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up give this video a like and share with anybody that you know that wants to activate the brightening effect of their body lotion 